Uh, before I begin, I just want to thank once more uh, Kitty and Julie for uh, convening the project that we're here to celebrate. Without their leadership, this clearly would not have happened. So thank you again. I think it's a, uh, actually a fitting metaphor that this new venture is called RAIN. I mean, Oregon, as you know, has a special relationship uh, with RAIN. Uh, we celebrate RAIN in Oregon. We embrace RAIN. Uh, we know that uh, rain nurses our soil and helps clean our air, and it makes our valleys and, and, uh, and our forests a medley of shades of green. Uh, author Roger Miller once said that some people walk in the rain and other people just get wet. <laughs> well, in Oregon, we don't just walk in the rain, we play in the rain, and we build wonderful and amazing things with it. And I think the rain that we're here to celebrate today is the kind of rain that we need a lot more of. Uh, here in the state of Oregon. By bringing entrepreneurs and their ideas together with the resources necessary to turn those ideas into companies, this community endeavor is going to make a lasting contribution, I think, to the Southern Willamette Valley. My vision for our state is very simple to state, but it requires uh, extraordinary effort to uh, actually uh, realize. And it's a vision of a place where every Oregonian, regardless of income or, or, or uh, geography or home language, uh, or race has an equal opportunity to meet their basic needs and to strive to achieve their full potential and to have hard work rewarded with a better life and to leave their children off better than they were, uh, both economically and environmentally. And a big part of that vision has to do with harnessing the myriad forms of energy around us, the uh, uh, energy from the waves in our ocean, the energy from the uh, wind in our skies and from our sun when it shines. But I think clearly the most important renewable energy resource that we have in our state is the creative energy of our entrepreneurs, of our innovators, and of our dreamers. And that energy is limited only by our imagination, and it can only be realized by investing in the education of our children, and fueling their curiosity, and empowering them to ask the most important question of all, what if? So today is a celebration of a remarkable community project, but it's also a validation, I think. It's a validation of the fact that when you bring together the public sector, the private sector, and the civic sector, along with people who are willing and able and excited to pool their resources so we can not only fuel our economy, but we can leave our kids better off tomorrow than they are today. And I think it's also a validation that we can always do more to leverage the tremendous resources of our two uh, premier research universities and cities and the counties and the communities they serve. And finally, as I think uh, both of you referred to, it is a validation of the fact that you can have regional collaboration even among rivals. <laughs> and uh, I'm sure the beavers and the ducks will continue to enjoy or perhaps endure uh, their rivalry, uh, knowing that uh, off the field and after the tailgating, we are all Oregonians working together to try to make a more prosperous future uh, for, uh, for all of us. When I visited uh, Eugene uh, 18 months, or less than 18 months ago, in January 2013, these two leaders said that, as you said, that they were all in uh, on this project, and the fact that the, uh, the uh, Declaration of Cooperation has been signed by the RAIN Governing Board suggests that they were not only all in, but they brought their communities along with them. And looking around the, the room today, we can see business leaders, local government leaders, and legislative leaders who also made this uh, remarkable uh, uh, project happen. I'm very excited to be able to point to this uh, as a model for other uh, regional uh, projects across the state, and I pledge my support alongside yours with my signature. And finally, I look forward to uh, hearing exciting stories about the new uh, shoots and sprouts and seedlings that are going to uh, grow here in the uh, Southern Willamette Valley Rain. So thank you very much. Thank you. Say in the army, sign and triplicate. Sign and triplicate, that's right. right. One for you. <laughs> One for me. One for you. <laughs> One for you. <laughs> <laughs> 